darn it. <laughs> Quit putting your booty in my face. <laughs> My name is Sherry McRae. I'm a Georgia peach. I have a wonderful husband who is a native Georgia boy. We're American by birth, Southern by the grace of God. I'm the mother of five children, four hearing and one deaf. Ty can do anything that hearing kids can. He just can't hear. I like to go off-roading. It's not fun when I can't get stuck. <laughs> My dad, he's an old man, but yes, he can still play some sports. He's pretty good. <laughs> you need to turn your burner on. Okay. Now that's a cute one. That's about how old he was when we found out he was deaf. When Ty was four months old, I had some ideas in my mind that, you know, something was just not right and I just couldn't put my finger on it or I didn't want to put my finger on it. My mother-in-law was up visiting one day and he was playing with her keys and he dropped them and I heard her call out, Sherry, I don't think he heard that. And when she said that, my knees buckled and I knew he didn't hear it. I was immediately was paralyzed with fear. I just started thinking of, you know, all the things he won't be able to do. And then Neil, on the other hand, you know, you hear if you're given lemons, you make lemonade. He was in the kitchen making lemonade and I was, you know, in my room with the door shut and didn't want to come out. I mean, sometimes I feel like quitting. I can't be a mom and quit. I want to make everything perfect for him, but I can't. I can only do what I can do, and I know the Lord's going to make up for the rest. I believe when Christ comes, he will be healed. He came home from a Valentine party in fourth grade, sobbing, and I will never forget him signing. I want Jesus to come now. I'm ready to hear. I want him to come now. And so I, I'm thankful for the knowledge that he will come. Almost every day I see something of God's power in our lives because of this. You know, with time coming into our lives it has made me stronger, it has made me more compassionate, maybe more like our Savior. I'm thankful that all of my children have had the opportunity to serve Him. And what I have learned from the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints is how service is how you show love. When, when they yell at me, I just don't hear nothing. <laughs> <laughs> they just sign bigger and faster and make and make their faces look like they're real bad. We are rednecks. Do we want to show that to all the world? Let me think about it. <laughs> you know, engines usually have a normal color. <laughs>